picked you because since you were Hercules and you're just such a leader and such an example of fitness and grit. And I just want to talk about, um, have you ever had to come from failing forward with lessons and, and has fitness helped you with any of that? Well, I'll tell you, I, I think the greatest lesson I learned on failure was when I was a caddy back when I was 18 and 19 years old during the summers there in Minnesota. I caddied at this private country club and my dad was a school teacher. So uh, my clothes, my hand-me-downs for my brothers, whatever money I could scrape to get my own. But I never felt without. My parents were awesome. Um, uh, but uh, I asked these guys, I said, how did you become so successful? Uh, and I was like I said, I was there for two summers. So I got to meet a lot of people out there. And they all said the same thing, which I found interesting. They all said I failed. And I failed again and I failed again. But I didn't use it as a negative. I used it as a positive. And people forget about that. I think too many people fail and give up so quickly on their goals and their dreams because they might fail once or a hundred times. Well, the reality is you got to keep pushing through it and you got to use those failures as a positive because you can learn something good from each thing that happens to you in negative ways. So when I moved to LA, uh, I mean, everybody's an actor in California. So you get out there and it's all about rejection in the industry of Hollywood. So you've got to get used to that and you've got to find a way to fight around that. So to me, the lesson I learned from those guys and also from my mom and dad about hard work paying off and don't expect handouts, go out there and work hard. And uh, I, I've always had a very good work ethic and I think that's paid off for me in so many ways.